Today, more than ever, I can sense winter's slow but steady approach. First day of December came wrapped in a thick blanket of fog. As winter settles outside, I find the need to settle in the warmth of my home. When nature goes to sleep and colors wither, I can only add color back with my own hands. This is what I would like to do. On this first day of December, surrounded by warm light, soft music and the smell of oranges permeating through the house. If you, like me, are seeking calm and comfort these days, I hope this video will bring you a few moments of that ever-needed peace. I won't speak much today, but talking isn't always needed when you're experiencing a comfortable kind of silence. When I was little, I found loads of pleasure in creating things by hand. Seeing something grow from zero and turn into something beautiful gives me immense joy.
Nowadays I find this pleasure in making videos and taking photos, noticing and capturing the details which may so often be overlooked. I was out this morning taking photos in the fog, and a man approached, asking, What do you see there? Beauty, I replied, and pointed at a tiny little weed covered in spider web and sparkling little dew droplets covering the withered flowers like crystals. But it's the same with everything, the pleasure of turning raw ingredients into something delicious, the curious change in nature as everything grows and dies again and again in never-ending cycle. A new project idea, like these Christmas ornaments I'm making today, which gets born from a mere thought and fills my home with warmth and color. I'm not actually good at many of these things. My baking projects fail often, my sewing is sloppy and uneven. This is, in fact, the first time I'm doing something like this. And sometimes I spend hours and hours on end trying to create a new story through my visuals. But that childlike enjoyment, even the tiniest bit of curiosity and desire to see what becomes of it, it's always there.
today I encourage you to make something of your own. Especially for those of us who live remotely, away from friends and family and might spend most of our time alone or in small groups this winter. It's valuable and important to show some love to your own homes. Creating something lovely just for yourself and those closest to you. Making your own space cozy and beautiful, filled with all the warm feelings you would like to cultivate. I hope this December brings you lots of joy wherever you are. I will speak to you soon.